I'm a fishbowl. Junkie. I'm a fishbowl. Junkie. Tell him again. I'm a fishbowl. Junkie. And I like it funky. Where's my snare? I need my I need my snare. Yo, what's that? Oh, it's like an Eminem reference. Dragon human. Oh, I thought you meant like the chocolates Eminem. No, nah, like don't You're getting the ball. No, nah, no, nah, like it's all good. Remember that ad though? Yeah. Welcome back to another episode of the Fish Bowl. Welcome. Holy! Uh, last episode was Trav one, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't like Trav one. Did you hear that? That was my dog. Is he? Dr- I wish we could get the mic onto that. That sounds disgusting. He just dry reached from licking his own cock. Imagine if we could behave like that. Like he's sitting right next to us and I just started licking my own just cock. Just legs straight up. And then went... <laughs> At you. <laughs> God. Oh, wow, we. Christ. What's going on? Hey, man. Hey, bud. How'd the travel yeah. going? Sorry for calling you, bud. It's all good. Um, Did I say champ? No, I didn't say champ. Nah, yeah. not at all. You didn't deserve that. It's <laughs> all good. called bud. Bugger logs. Um, it's cold. Weather yeah. sucks. Um, Peak what else winter. is new? Peak winter right now for us, and it sucks. Grim. It's been... The most dog shit winter, in my opinion. It's been all right until like a week ago where it just decided to do nothing but rain. Yeah. It's like it was all right. Like cold mornings, the days were yeah, like it's like sunny. Whatever. It was good. It was and now it's just like, fuck all of you. Mm-hmm. Here's a million liters of rain. <laughs> just yeah. like that. Yep. And um, it wrecks everything. Everything. But- Whatever, we're staying positive. You know why? Because the Olympics are on. <laughs> How good? Love them. Are you excited? Stoked. Pretty crazy that we know two people in the Olympics. Who's the other one? Oh, oh well, Harry Garside. Oh, we don't. Our claim to fame is we went to school with him. Yeah, correct. Um, and Cal O'Brien. Shout out to Cal O'Brien. But Cal O'Brien, our actual friend. I've been to I've been to Tep and Yaki with him. All right, I'm act. I I can't qualify myself as a friend. I have a photo with him. We were on the same basketball team for about three years in a row. Shit, I used to BMX race with him actually. True. Back like he was like my he was my first friend. Oh, really? BMX friend. Oh, shout out to Cal. Shout out to Cal. K E L L. By the way, yeah, Cal. Cal. Not Cal. It's Cal. Cal. Hey, Cal. Isn't it Calend? I think it could be. Yeah. O'Brien. O'Brien. Oh, O'Brien. Oh, 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 so Brian. that's our friend who's in the Olympics. That's pretty cool. Um, um, what What are you m- most excited to see Olympic-wise, sport-wise? Um, look, I'm pretty basic with the Olympics. I quite enjoy the athletic side of it. I don't mm. like watching 100-meter sprint. Mm. Mm-hmm. How about yourself? Don't know. It's very, I mean, you know me, I'm not a huge sport guy, mm. but um, I've just been super, couldn't give too okay, much well of a fuck Okay, well, you say you're it. not a sports guy, but here's where it if gets ha- interesting. You're an action sports guy, and that is now very, very, very in, in the it. Olympics. How do you feel about that? I hate it. I think it's a little, I feel like BMX racing made sense. Yep. Because it's more athlete based. Like yep. it's a clear winner. You beat him, oh, yep. you've won. Oh yeah, yeah. Where yep. like skating and the band, like obviously love watching all of it. It's yep. fantastic. But I think it's just a bit odd because it's like it's judged. I don't know. Yep. But then yep. again, the same thing, like all the gymnastics shit's judged as well. I couldn't agree more. I think it's an X Games thing. It has its place. And like don't get me wrong, I love it. Yeah. But not in the Olympics. It's got its own thing. X Games. I don't know. It's pretty cool. And I mean, we've got Logan Martin, so it's kind of cool that we'll probably win that again. Break dancing. I don't want to talk about it. He's in the Olympics. Break dancing as well is weird. It's like they dance. It's like how many flips can you do in 10 seconds? Do they dance to the same song? Good question. I'd say how is that judged? Well, I guess it maybe goes off like you pick a song and how well you can choreograph to that song. Yeah, I, I thought it would have been... It'd what's be cool what? if it was just the one song and everyone just had what to... Song would, what song would you choose? Oh, Actually, um, they probably have their own, like, beats. I think I don't think there's words, just like... No. Nah. Well, 
Yeah. It's just a 15 second long handstand. <laughs> like, um, summer high tie with Jonah and he, all his boys. You haven't, that's right, idiot. <laughs> He's never seen summer high tie. I don't like Chris Lilly. Yeah, good on you, buddy. You're so woke and shit with your bleach no, hair now. No, no. I didn't like him before my bleached hair. I like your bleached hair. Bleached hair just made me hate him. Geordie has bleached hair I'm now, bleached by the hair. way. We did that for your birthday. I'm. Socially known or accepted as fun now, I think. How many Slim Shadies have you copped? About 16. Is he over it? Um, Not yet. Everyone, it's like they've just got to like say it once and then they like don't care. It's like, oh, Slim Shady. It's like, good one. What do you do? Just, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Dap them up. You can say that shit again. Or <laughs> you pull me real close. <laughs> <laughs> you want to regret it. Woke up this morning. But uh, what else are you not feeling in the Olympics? Um, Equestrian? You like that? Oh, it's been there forever, so it's kind of whatever. You like tradition? It's fine. I think it's crazy that the, the horses just have to get transported so far. Horses on a plane. That's hectic. That's a different version. Yeah, cool movie. Yeah. Horses on a, Do they get... Are they motherfucking the horses sling? off nah. this motherfucking plane. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> horses. Horses. No way they're put asleep though, are they? I don't think so. Oh, I reckon they'd fucking have to be. That'd be so stressful. That could fuck with them. Or that could... Well, they've got to, I think they've got to away. send them there like a few weeks prior so they can get there and like relax yeah. and, you know... Have you have seen how horses and that live in like Japan and shit? Hotels. Come again? Horses, Japan, hotels. They live in hotels. Kind of. Hotel, motel. It's like they're stables. Damn. Yeah. That's crazy. Well, I'm not sure. My mum told me. But no, she's a horse girl. <laughs> Checks out. <laughs> yeah. <I guess. laughs> horse girls. What do you thought? <laughs> Woohoo! No comment. You ever dated a horse girl? No. Mm. No. I don't think, yeah. Thank I, God. I can't see you being in places where there would be horse girls. They get around. Not now, yeah. though, because all horse girls now are all just country. And I stand. Triple I, country. I am so far from country. Anyway, I just want, I've got the list of just taking it back to the Olympics real quick before we get down the rabbit hole of horse why horse. I don't like country. Um, you went to a rodeo. I did. And had fun. So. <sighs> Judo. Uh, Judo. Cha- don't mind it. Like you said, there's a clear winner. Surfing's weird. I think surfing's weird in the Olympics. Yeah. No, especially weird. when it's not anywhere near the rest of the Olympics. Mm. Like this year, it's in Tahiti, which... Well, yeah, they just can't do it everywhere. Don't... Is, is Tahiti a, an island... Don't just owned? fart? No, it was me. I didn't oh. fart, but I made a weird noise. Oh, okay. Is Tahiti a, owned by the French... Uh, by the French or something. That's why it's there. Yeah, I'm not too sure. I Surely this is not all of the Olympic sports. Can't be. Give me some more. BMX racing, mountain bike. Where's skateboarding? Is that there? It is there. Damn, there's only like one, two, three, four, five. Oh, but there's probably like more. If you're in the Olympics for... I definitely thought that there was more sports than that. True. Water polo? Apparently, it's pretty brutal. They, like, scratch each other and stuff under the water. wonder if you got to, like, cut your turkey nails. Oh, yeah. They would have, like, nail regulations Ooh. for sure. For sure. <laughs> Getting that for sure. Shooting's cool. I like that. Um, Surely the Americans I are think gunners at that. Golf wigs me out a bit. And I love golf. Yeah, but that go- in the Olympics not, yeah. is a bit, bit mm-hmm. odd. I like the diving. The diving's cool. Trampolining's cool. All the, all the gymnastic stuff's cool. I can't be bothered with swimming. Uh, like swimming's kind of boring. I don't, I don't mind. I, I like freestyle swimming. Damn. I don't like this weird like butterfly and all that stuff. Backstroke. Just get in the water and see who's quick. <laughs> Swim however you want. They should Do they do endurance swimming? I guess that's like a triathlon, isn't it? Yeah, that's like Ironman stuff. 
Well, they should just see them, who can do the most laps. Oh, just whoever like, carks it first yeah. loses. Yep. I, I think that there should just be one swimming race and whoever's quickest, you win. And mm. you can swim however you want. It's just whoever's mm. fastest. Football. They talk about, don't they're about soccer? There's both. Like rugby. And I think football in here is soccer. Okay. Yeah, well, I guess... Tennis as rugby. well? Tennis. Nah, tennis is not an Olympic but sport. Tennis is the thing. Anyway, is for the whatever. Yeah. Whatever. Even volleyball. I was watching that the other day. That was pretty That's funny. so dumb. It's pretty funny. Like, you, just go to the I don't beach. know. Just... It's crazy. So the, the athletes and stuff, I feel like, say, with basketball, because there's a huge out of the Olympics. But, like, there's the ones that, like, they just... Olympics is, like, their... Like they're th- like they they wait four years. Yeah, it's weird how different countries approach the Olympics. Some don't care, some do care, and we haven't even spoke about the village. How it's just a big fuck fest. There's one here that just says breaking. Does that mean break dancing? Like it just says yeah. it just says if there isn't break dancing on the list. I, I reckon it means that breaking. Hey, um, yeah, that that looks shocking right. as well. I speaking of it being shit and cold, snow. I can't see myself going there at all this year. No. Um, they're because they're smart. They've yeah. set it up so that if you're gonna do anything, you got to buy like the season pass. Yeah. Like that's just how it works. Which honestly is not too bad. But I what is it like nine hundred bucks? I think. Mm, I got no idea. I don't know, but like, what is it? Oh, Buller's not too bad, but there's no shit at Buller. But Buller, I think during the week is like. I don't know, 140 bucks some. How much? 140. For what though? Day pass. That's it. Just your lifts? Yeah. But then what you gotta pay? Your parking, about sixty. You got fuel, it's probably about hundred bucks. Oh. Food. Food. Which is fucking you have food, to sacrifice first. a body part. It'll cost you probably four hundred bucks a day. <laughs> you can do it cheaper and you can like noodles in the saucepan, but you're still spending two to three hundred bucks just to get up there. Why is it so expensive? I don't know. Bes- Inflation. Besides the lift, which I get because it's man-made. Yeah, it's mechanical. Someone's got to operate it, blah, blah, blah. Service it, blah, blah. But it's snow. You didn't do anything. Nope. It's just cold and happens to fall out of the sky. It's like paying for the rain. Like, it's just natural. It's, it's the same. I mean, I could be wrong. I'm not very... Uh, like, correct with a lot of my statements. Have a go. <coughs> <laughs> but it's because obviously Buller has a lot of, or every snowman has a lot of employees. Mm-hmm. Employees need more money because everything else is more expensive. Therefore, ticket prices for said mountain go up. Mm. It's like a vicious cycle. Yeah. Too expensive, can't do it, need more money, get more money because they've got more money, need to put the price up, and it's just going to keep going. I'd like to see a stat. There's like way Shit. less people have gone to the snow in the last couple of years or what? Well, it's fine because it's close to the city and they get all the tourists. Yeah. And and then Hotham and Falls, just, they've got their season pass because they're owned by another company, and then people, heaps of blokes just do that and they go out there for like a week or two. Or get week. stuffed. I'm just it's going <sighs> to Mount Donna. It sucks. Yeah. I don't reckon I'll be snowboarding, which, which, is, which is upsetting. I'm going to go at least once a year, but it's like mm. trying to go to Europe. <laughs> Fuck that joint. Europe. Okay, therefore. <laughs> to know why I won't have to go back. Yeah, okay. I can tell you. I will probably want to, we want to go back. It's at least the sun will be out there. Where do you want to go? Uh, so, as far as I can see. <laughs> shit. Nah. Not yet. Oh, my bad. Um, Spain. So, Barcelona. Paris. Berlin. And Thessaloniki. <laughs> Where? It's in Greece. Yeah, okay. It's got nice beaches there. Okay. I actually never but, been. But I've never been either. I'm just going off the photos of their beaches, and I think they look shit. 
So you look at it. Yeah, there's probably no sand, but the water looks phenomenal. Fucking. Fucking. <laughs> bro. Bali. Been there. Go back. Go back. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah no, Bali cool. is crazy. We need to do a Bali trip. That place is wild. Remember when we were meant to go to Thailand for yeah. um, COVID? Yeah. Hectic, that. COVID. Let's not get into that. No. Everything always just returns back to COVID. Any discussion ever. Hey, I'm thirsty. <clears throat> I'm also severely parched. Should we indulge in a refreshing beverage? Yes, and then we should review it. Okay. Be review. Okay. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another beer review. <laughs> this time it's a little different. Can we get like a beer review intro of just like a diddle 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 diddle? Make something up right now. I just did it. That was it? That was it. Maybe we should just stick to not having one. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now, ladies and gentlemen, holy, this is a little different. What do you call this beer? This is called Jack Daniels Cola. Tennessee whiskey. <laughs> Never had whiz key beer before. Say again. Never had whiz key. That's because it's not beer. Oh. This is a perfectly mixed 4.8%. Uh, yeah, look, you all know what a Jack Daniels is. Yeah, we're drinking Jack Daniels. We don't we, have we, a beer today. We, we, um, what happened last night? We... It felt a little bit different, didn't we? Yeah, we uh, went to the pub and had a beer. And then when we left the pub, we were like, oh, we're obviously going back to mine. And we both felt like if we had a beer, we'd probably just fall asleep. Beer is great when you're doing something. Mm. Beer on the couch is great until you're asleep. Yeah, and that 100% would have happened. Um, so we got back and not going to lie. I wish I did just fall asleep because that movie sucked. <laughs> um, you're probably the only person that I've spoken to that's watched that said that was a terrible movie. Oh my God. Kane will have the same answer because he hates all the movies that I recommend to him. That's fine. It's fine. It's whatever. Oh, sorry. Uh, the movie we watched was, uh, we'll talk about that after. Anyway. We're, let's step. Shut get, up. A little bit into that, into this. On it. Fuck. This is dangerous because Gorgeous. I personally enjoy beer, not just because of its taste, but it's cheap. Uh we never do this. Never. I don't reckon until last night I hadn't had a Jack Daniels for at least three years, I reckon. We only venture on out to like hard solos. Mm-hmm. We don't even give it's, a go it's like fighting juice. We don't even really give Canadians a go. I feel like just kicking something. Really? Mm. I feel like sitting down and enjoying it with my friends. Not me, man. All right, so there's like on this mic stand, just a quick update so everyone knows what I'm dealing with. Mm. There's a little shiny nut here. Oh, yep. And every time I kind of look this way, I'm just staring myself down the barrel. Why don't you twist it? Because if it's still, th- it's still there. Nah, twist this like I have. Nah, twist that. Yeah. Then it's <laughs> and now twist it again. I can't. I can't. Just grow up. Got to sit here. Sorry. That's fine. Hey, um, honestly, I rate that. It is refreshing. Like there is not much wrong with that at all. There's one thing. Go. It just cost too much. Oh yeah. It's pretty cool though. What do we spend? Fifty bucks on ten pack. <laughs> you spend fifty bucks on a slab of beer. True. Well, you did one day, but. But you know what the best thing is to me is a can. It's a nice can, can is kind oh, of I unbeatable. I love their bottles. Yeah, like yeah. Like sh- You drink them like stabby. That. Yeah. They you are. drunk, you drink that. They're nice to hold and to look at. These to me are, a, are an eight. I do enjoy that people are listening to this and we're just rambling on about Jack Daniels. I don't reckon there'd be too many people who would disagree though. Mm-mm. I love a black can too. Mm. I like when they have like gold. Oh, yeah. Or gold or black. Like, on how much more that costs to get made? I don't know. Probably never know. No. Maybe one day. Bring out a beer. 
Mm. What do you give it? Like seven and a half. Shit. Out of ten. Really? Yeah, I think it just it just sits well. I mean, it's got a little bit of caffeine in it, so like you get your. <laughs> Ooh, you know. Yeah, it did, and it did, didn't it? Like you could yeah. definitely tell. Well, we difference. sat through the whole movie. Let's be real. If we were drinking beer, we would have just. Fuck! I wish we didn't. But me, mm. a um, where where? Pretty fucking happy with that. Mm. Now, what's next? This movie. Anyone oh. actually seen what was it called? Midsummer. Midsummer. Fucking dog shit. Nah. So if you are listening and you have watched it. Fucking let us know how shit it was or how wrong I am. I, I doubt anyone will Because it was weird I'm wrong. and shit was happening and it's kind of like gory and fucked up. But it's not like, like I hate jump scare movies. Shit like that are dumb. But like suspenseful thrillers where you're like, what the fuck is going on here? <laughs> and it was just good. Uh, fucking, I just not about the whole like culty. That's why it's interesting though because it's so fucking Odd. Hmm. Odd. Do you ever join a cult? Would I ever? Yeah. Depends what the cult does. I don't really know. The only thing I know of cults are on a bad stuff. Well, that's a good point. Hopefully. What's the difference between a cult and a gang? I don't know if like religious beliefs kind of come into it or it's like, should I look up the definition of a cult? Should I do that? Or maybe... Jeremy, bring that up for me real quick. <laughs> Let's look up the difference between a cult and a gang. Or what is it like? A, what makes a cult a cult? Maybe religion. You could be right with that. I was going to put in cult definition. I think you'd be right. Everyone that's listening. I was right. Shit. <laughs> a system of religious veneration, ven- sorry, veneration and devotion directed towards a particular figure or object. Okay. So technical. Ooh, I'm not going to say technically. You can correct me if you want. Which you probably will, but is that wrong? Not saying like Christianity is not a cult then, because it's yeah. a religious faith or whatever, according to God, or they all are, to well, a figure, I guess, yeah, or object. But oh, now it's put in is is isn't a cult as well a name for your cult something? What do you mean? Like a uh, brand. you know, like a flock of birds. Isn't a cult? Something for something. Am I making sense? Are you even listening? Yeah, I am. I'm trying to see if there's a difference. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> I'm pretty sure a cult is like a group of something. Oh, yeah. A group. Google that a cult me, is a group requiring unwavering devotion to a set of beliefs and practices which are considered deviant outside the norms of society. What? The word deviant is weird. Deviant. Cult of something. What is it? Well, uh, surely someone is listening. A again. cult of... <laughs> is it personality? Wait, no, that's sure. that's even flow. A cult of personality. Right, not sure. I um, <laughs> fucking... <laughs> What else have you got for me? What's been going on? Hair's blonde. Yeah. Um, I felt one of those people. Uh, or and so so good. like my entire personality is my hair. Oh, okay. Right now. Do you feel like it has changed? Your p- I think it has. When I go... Different. When I go... <laughs> Into public, yeah. and I was at the shopping cent, mm-hmm. the supermarket, oh, oh. and oh, you just think that <clears throat> everyone's looking at you. So last night when we were walking around at that, and market, it felt kind of good when we were at that market, and you know how like when we we're walking around, usually it's just us or whatever. Like you might do a funny little walk, you might. Have an outburst of uh, laughter or a weird noise or something. Now when you do it, you look like a freak. I think I did anyway. Nah, before it was just like, oh, look at that normal guy with mousy brown hair just 
having fun. Having fun. Now when you look do that, it, everyone's look like, that, look that freak. That fucking <laughs> idiot. Bleached hair. God. Ooh, walking weird. But he's got problems. Ew. Yeah. Ooh, Eminem, you know, go back yeah, to 2001 yeah. or something. Yeah. Weird though, if it was any other color, it probably, oh, uh, actually. Oh. I think it's weird. Depends what color you do it. Like if you dyed your hair hot pink, everyone would just think, oh, he's he's, he's a bit different. He's alternative. He's, he's weird. He's quirky. But yeah, but when you do bleached, people think, oh, look at this cool guy from Fitzroy. Mm. You know what I mean? Fit you in. feel like that cool guy from One Fitzroy? of us. One of us. Uh, I feel like, nah, because I feel like it, if I went to Fitzroy, but he's trying too hard. Oh, nah. I feel, like it's now, I feel like it's now reversed. Like Fitzroy are like. You have to do something Brunswick. a bit weirder. Yeah, they're too quick with it over there. Yuck. I don't know what they're doing over there. I haven't been there for a while. Don't know. I did go to the city um, last weekend. Is that when I shot that engagement? Yes. I fucking hate the city. It's an interesting place. I don't mind it purely just for the options of things and a lot of food, a lot of bars, a lot of places to go, people to see. Awesome. Love Traffic that. shits me up the wall. Hate that. And I just wanted to remove everyone who was there. I just link the city with shit weather. I feel like every time I seem to go to the city, it's always cold or windy or raining. So I haven't been in the city besides for the football Foot. in fucking ages. Mm-hmm. Like, oh, well over a year. And when you go for the football, it's different because... You're not quite in the city. You're not, and you're there for one reason. So everyone else around you is also there for that reason. Yep. So there's a certain group of people. Yep, they're all the same as you. But I went last Sunday to shoot an engagement around the exhibition centre. Oh, my goodness gracious. Near IMAX? Yeah. Yep. That Good sucked. That Didn't sucked. Like it. Why? Oh, just the people. Why? Oh, I just bloody um. Why? It was just the uh, I don't know. I didn't like it. I Why? Because they're probably enjoying themselves, doing nothing. Nah. No. Nah. Doing too much. Okay. Just relax a bit, you know. And mm. I don't want to be judgy on what people are wearing. Mm. But what the fuck? What was the weirdest thing you saw? Parachute pants. They can get in the bin. It's a fucking hammer time. What is that? Do, 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 do. What is Touches. that? What do you mean by parachute pants? Ones where they have the little zip cord at the bottom? Not necessarily, but the ones that are about this wide on one leg. Not the other leg. And when you walk, it's like... Whoosh, 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 whoosh. Just, like, the, just the noise of walking when there's no other sounds around. It's the biggest look at me. I'm a cockhead. I just... Bloke or woman? All sorts. Okay. Probably half of half. Half of half. Half and half. Half and half. Ow. <laughs> yeah, yeah, buddy. Shit. Yeah. It's kind of like, it all just does one of these ones. That's good Straight for you. Straight over the head. I feel like you say that, but if I get you in a certain, well, not I get you in certain moods that you can get in. Oh, there are. I'll like, see something like, and I'll be like, oh, that's, that's. Bold. That's a lie when you say, just yeah, just straight up my head because I'm a cool bleached hair guy. It doesn't even affect me. I just, <laughs> you know, it. I avoid those people. Uh-huh. Let them do their thing. Okay. Get on them. Do you, they just work. Thanks, man. <laughs> Could be. We get off camera. Come yeah, in. Oh, <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> uh, I, uh, oh, actually, wait, you better, you better wrap it up. Almost, but go. I, was just I gonna- had a, a oh. thing. Happened the other um, the other day. It's not a bad thing. It just made me think. Like it's happened numerous times, and I think it's quite humorous. Mm-hmm. So obviously, like whether it be from a workplace or school, and there's obviously you know people. You know people around. They know who you are. Yep. And I went to the coffee shop the other day, and as I opened the door, uh, this person <laughs> from my high school was in said coffee shop, and they were like had a tray of things, and they were. Walking out, but as I've opened the door, we've both looked like locked eyes with each other, and we've just kind of telepathically been like, "I know you." Oh. Said no words. We're just like, oh. mm, "Okay," and you just have this mutual agreement of like, 
I, I recognize you. I know who you are, but I'm not going to, I'm going to pretend like I've never seen you before. And you just go about your daily life. Whew. Never had that? A hundred percent. But I need to know more. Did you like raise an eyebrow? No, I just acted like I didn't know them. They did Were the same thing. Were you both coming out the door? Hang on a sec. Keep talking. Mm-hmm. Um, did you come out of the door at the same time? So I was walking in, they were walking out with food wow. to give to a table outside. Did but you I, hold a door open? I did hold them? the door open. Oh, oh, wow. But it was just like, and I was, there was not like one, because I didn't say like, oh my God, how you going? Look, could have, didn't. Mm-hmm. Neither did they. They were just like, keep walking. Like they just, they, yeah. I, yeah, I knew Wow. And they were like, you know, what can I get you today? Oh, just a... Fucking, Where was it? Fucking chicken burger. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What suburb were you? Look at that. Hometown as Hometown. well. Hometown. Oh. Another reason why I hate mm. doing like anything around where I live because I don't like these interactions. Mm-hmm. Unless it's with someone I do know. And you're like, oh, you go. But even then half the time, I kind of can't be fucked. I thought you were just cool bleach hair guy. I just went straight over your head. That's about clothes. Sorry. It's different. <laughs> yeah. I'm cool bleached hair guy and not my hometown. I be cool if they are listening to this. That's why I haven't said There's no fucking way they are, but what they are. <laughs> well sh- you just never know these days, imagine, do you? Imagine like she went Well there you go. I've been saying them and they this whole time. Now oh. you just really you really just pinned it down to <laughs> this, <laughs> this fucking name. guy. Imagine like they Went home and we're like, oh, I'm gonna see what that guy's up to nowadays. Oh, he's put out they a do podcast. Like stalk oh, oh, it's a podcast. And <laughs> and I also want to know because obviously in my head I've gone, oh my god, they look exactly the same. Mm-hmm. Like she's looked at you. Oh, what the <laughs> fuck happened to you? <laughs> Gee whiz. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I'm trying to think of another instance, but I definitely oh, have another day, it. and that was that was interesting. I just enjoy that. It's like a mutual agreement of like, we're going to, pre- we know who we are to each other, but we're going to pretend like we've never seen each other before. Well, I had it and our kids interacted. Oh yeah, I do recall. And that was weird. So you didn't talk to them? Nope. Crazy. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Nah, I was just like, <laughs> <laughs> like cool, cool shit. kid. They, um. So what high school did you get? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, nah, that was that was strange. Mm. But it's not because I don't want to. It's more probably my brain going like, you probably don't want to. Yeah. And if you haven't said anything, you probably want to talk. But then they're probably thinking, yeah. oh, they haven't said anything, so yeah. they probably don't want to talk. And then also, depending on the person, I, I'm probably just like, yeah, I, I, I don't want to talk to you. But it's the only thing like, a lot of like these people, I didn't really like. You spoke to them at school, but not you weren't mates. You spoke to them because you probably had to. Yeah. Did you ever become friends with someone that you went to school with, but then you become friends with them outside of school? Mm. That to me is crazy. Wait, so you, you went to the same school, you weren't friends with them at school, but yeah. then you left school and then become friends, or maybe just met each other again and were like, oh. I remember you from school. You're actually all right. Well, that's like Taylor's girlfriend. Your brother's girlfriend. Same year level. Probably never spoke to her. And now she's at your house. Yep. She's a nice lady. Hectic, that. Yep. It's pretty... I won't lie. Let's even if she's listening to this, second. that was a pretty... Pretty w- odd. So just to... If you missed what he just said, Jordan's brother, Taylor is dating a girl from Jordan's school. Same year level. Same year. Same classes? Any? No. No? Oh, Maybe? No. Put it, I never spoke to her at high school. And then you get home from work one day, and she's sitting in your spot on the couch. Mm. It's just a... You know, kissing was, your brother. <laughs> <laughs> and you're like, that's my brother. <laughs> <laughs> I like his hip. And now you're like, yeah, it's crazy. It's just weird. Yeah, but it just got like nothing wrong with her. 
No. It was just very strange. And I'm like, I know you. Like, we are doing that interaction thing. We're like, hmm. Hi, how you going? But like, we knew, we, like, I know you. She's like, I know you. What? Even, so the first time you no, seen I don't, her. I don't think so. Nothing. No, I was still like, how you going? Like, what the hell? Oh, so you made it pretty clear you knew. Had to. This woman's yeah. in my house. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Didn't have an yeah, option. Yeah. Yeah, fair enough. How you been? You been good? That's good. Yeah, that's crazy. I just, I just sleep there. Don't go there. That's my room. Yeah, okay. Please. No, nice. It's just... Now your boys. Well... No, she's 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 yeah. a ripper. She's a ripper there. She's a what? She's a ripper. Oh, she's please, she's a stripper. No, really, she's a teacher. <laughs> At Upper Yarra, too. Of really? All places. Yeah, she deals oh, what? With, the, with the shit. Really? Yeah. Sorry, Liv, we're talking about you a lot. I've just, yeah. You said her name, you yep. said where she works. Well, we just said Taylor's girlfriend. Oh, so, so and then you said her name, yeah. Where she works, mm. and her address. <laughs> there, I think they're at the Flinders Rangers at the moment. Yeah. Yeah. Looks Killing hectic. It. Does look hectic. Hey, can I play you a little sound? Me? Yeah, can I play you one? Go on. Okay, so, right, we're about to wrap it up, but I am sick and fucking tired of this secret sound. Okay. Mm. You guys suck. One of you. Sorry, but. Need to get this fucking sound. It's. I think the clue that we said ages ago was someone is throwing something onto something. I don't think that has. Or been dropping it. something onto something. It's a sound of something like. That might be the first. No, we've said that thing. ages Have ago. we said that for a clue? Yeah. It's a pretty good clue, that. I would have remembered that. But like, that's a good. Fuck. One. Do we say this is the last episode that we're doing this? I can think. Nah, it, this thing's would. going forever. If, if it, oh. someone's got to get this. Look, and I do feel as though the longer it goes on, the better the prize will be. So maybe if you know it and you're waiting for the prize to get, it's currently bigger, a getaway vacation to Gold Coast. All expenses paid with two thousand dollars spending money. You hear that? So Hilton. Mm-hmm. Hilton. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I'm gonna play it. I have to get up because. I'm going to press the button. But here it is. Wait a sec. Press it. One more time. Mm. Uh, Figure it out. We just played it twice. Okay. Do we say... I'm trying to think of another clue that's like... I liked your one. Subtle. That was good. Um, something onto something. Like something being thrown onto something. It is a... Sp- nah... Nope. That's too far. Mm. <laughs> I liked your clue. All right, all right, all right, all right. So, uh, yeah. Good luck. Um, hurry up and get it. Um, we got some pretty exciting stuff coming. We are going to have some beanies yeah. soon. Some beanies. beanies. This shit weather. Yeah. And, and it'll warm your head. you look good. Look you'll good. Feel, feel good. good. Yep. We're going on a bright... Again. Again, would you believe it? No. This one should be pretty bloody fun. Golf. We are golfing? 100%. All right, relax. Well, hey, 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 hey. Go. Oh, my back hurts. Oh, I don't think I can play today. You need to pick and choose when you like to make fun <laughs> of my injuries. <laughs> Because I can day, make I can make fun one of your day injuries. You, go, no, you shouldn't fucking joke about that. You should have stayed in the hospital. And then, and then today you're laughing at me. Yeah, because you didn't stay in the hospital. So no, you can laugh. So if we're playing, because I was, I, I, I won't lie to you. I was pretty bummed out. I was very excited. It was a beautiful day. Was too. And I was pretty keen to go smack some balls and st- uh, ruin a good walk, as they say. Oh, to make up for my, uh, I think. <laughs> <laughs> Are you fucking kidding? Me? <laughs> I just seen <laughs> into Mono's intestines. <laughs> you saw that too, surely. That thing stared at me. <laughs> it- Holy fuck! <laughs> I can't oh even. Oh my god! And then <laughs> like it like googled at me. <laughs> oh, I 
got to end it there. If you want to see what just happened, you'll have to watch this. They can't. They won't see it, thank God. But anyway, beanies are out. There's another Bride Trip video coming for Shell. Yeah. That's for Shell. Um, yeah, we probably need to get some more merch going. Let us know what merch you want. Yeah. Do... Yeah, send us a message. Like, is there anything yeah, you guys slightly want? redone? Maybe hoodies on a T-shirt, some, some more fucking stubby sh- sh- holders. Mm. This was just a fucker. You want a key ring? We'll Wait, give you key, key ring. ring. This was just a chill, sexy vibes episode. Nothing hectic. Um, hope you enjoyed it. Yeah. Footy starts in oops, eight minutes. So one ten. Yeah. Weird. Or one twenty. Oh, excuse me. So we got to go. All right. So we'll see you next time. Yeah, 110. Bye.